Stochastic gradient descent is a gradient descent optimization method for minimizing an objective function that is written as a sum of differentiable functions. Background Both statistical estimation and machine learning consider the problem of minimizing an objective function that has the form of a sum. Where the parameter is to be estimated and where typically each sum and function is associated with the th observation in the data set. In classical statistics, some minimization problems arise in least squares and in maximum likelihood estimation. The general class of estimators that arise as minimizers of sums are called M estimators. However, in statistics, it has been long recognized that requiring even local minimization is too restrictive for some problems of maximum likelihood estimation, as shown for example by Thomas Ferguson's example. Therefore, Contemporary statistical theorists often consider stationary points of the likelihood function. The sum minimization problem also arises for empirical risk minimization, in this case, is the value of loss function at th example, and is the empirical risk. When used to minimize the above function, a standard gradient descent method would perform the following iteration sir. Where is a step size? In many cases, the sum and functions have a simple form that enables inexpensive evaluations of the sum function and a sum gradient. For example, in statistics, one parameter exponential families allow economical function evaluations and gradient evaluations. However, in other cases, evaluating the sum gradient may require expensive evaluations of the gradients from all sum and functions. When the training set is enormous and no simple formulas exist, Evaluating the sums of gradients becomes very expensive, because evaluating the gradient requires evaluating all the sum and functions gradients. To economize on the computational cost at every iteration, stochastic gradient descent samples a subset of sum and functions at every step. This is very effective in the case of large scale machine learning problems. Iterative method In stochastic gradient descent, the true gradient of is approximated by a gradient at a single example. As the algorithm sweeps through the training set, it performs the above update for each training example. Several passes can be made over the training set until the algorithm converges, if this is done, the data can be shuffled for each pass to prevent cycles. Typical implementations may use an adaptive learning rate so that the algorithm converges. In pseudocode, Stochastic gradient descent can be presented as follows. A compromise between the two forms called mini-batches computes the gradient against more than one training examples at each step. This can perform significantly better than true stochastic gradient descent because the code can make use of vectorization libraries rather than computing each step separately. It may also result in smoother convergence, as the gradient computed at each step uses more training examples. The convergence of stochastic gradient descent has been analyzed using the theories of convex minimization and of stochastic approximation. Briefly, when the learning rates decrease with an appropriate rate, and subject to relatively mild assumptions, stochastic gradient descent converges almost surely to a global minimum when the objective function is convex or pseudoconvex, and otherwise converges almost surely to a local minimum. This is in fact a consequence of the robin siegmund theorem. Example, let's suppose we want to fit a straight line to a training set of two-dimensional points using least squares. The objective function to be minimized is. The last line in the above pseudocode for this specific problem will become. Applications, stochastic gradient descent is a popular algorithm for training a wide range of models in machine learning, including support vector machines, logistic regression and graphical models. It competes with the LBFGS algorithm, which is also widely used. SGD has been used since at least 1960 for training linear regression models, originally under the name of Darlin. When combined with a backpropagation algorithm, it is the de facto standard algorithm for training artificial neural networks. Another popular stochastic gradient descent algorithm is the least mean squares adaptive filter. Variance, due to the inherently sequential nature of stochastic gradient descent, the algorithm does not readily benefit from being run in parallel or distributed system environments. It is, however, 
a common choice among optimization algorithms in machine learning. As such, there are several variants of SGD which aim to address this. Asynchronous SGD, originally introduced as a method for running SGD on multi-core, single machine architectures. The algorithm operates without locking the decision variable. All cores have access to copies of the decision variable, in shared memory, and updates to the variable can happen at any time, potentially overwriting progress. This method is effective when the data set being operated on is sparse. Downpour SGD In 2012 Google released a paper detailing another variant of SGD which runs asynchronously as part of a distributed system framework dubbed Dist Belief. The method runs in a similar fashion to Hogwild, but uses adaptive gradient learning rate algorithm, ADAGRAD, as opposed to a single fixed value. The training data and decision variable being operated on are distributed across several machines, however variable updates are made to a centralized parameter server. References, Ferguson, Thomas S. An Inconsistent Maximum Likelihood Estimate. Journal of the American Statistical Association 77, 831 a Euro 834 doi, 10.1080 slash 01621459.1982.10477894. JSTORA 2287314A, Botau, La Copyright On. Busquet, Olivier. Advances in Neural Information Processing Systems 20 PPA 161 a Euro 168 a, Botau, La Copyright On. Online Algorithms and Stochastic Approximations. Online Learning in Neural Networks. Cambridge University Press. ISBN A 978-0-521-65263-6 QL. Exist of C convergence and efficiency of subgradient methods for quasi convex minimization. Mathematical programming 90 PPA 1 Euro 25 DOI 10.1007 slash PL0011414. ISNA 025 5610. MRA 1819784. Robbins, Herbert. Siegmund. David O. A. Convergence Theorem for Non-Negative Almost Super Martingales and Some Applications. In Rostorgi, Jagdish S. Optimizing Methods in Statistics. Academic Presser, Jenny Rose Finkel, Alex Kleeman, Christopher D. Manning. Efficient, feature-based, conditional random field parsing. Proc. Annual Meeting of the ACL. Citation Needed, R. V. Pfeffer. CS 181 Lecture 5 A Euro Perceptrons. Harvard University A, Nayu, Feng. Hogwild. A lock free approach to parallelizing stochastic gradient descent. Neural Information Processing Systems A, Dean, Jeffrey. Large scale distributed deep networks. Neural Information Processing Systems A, Bertzkers, Dimitri. Convex Analysis and Optimization. Athena Scientifica, Bertzkers, Dimitri P. Nonlinear Programming. Cambridge, Massachusetts. Athena Scientific. ISBN A 1 886529 0 0 La Copyright On. Stochastic Learning. Advanced Lectures on Machine Learning. LNAI 3176. Spring of Erlag PPA 146 Euro 168. ISBN A 978-3-540-23122-6. Daviden, WSC New Least Square Algorithms. Journal of Optimization Theory and Applications 18 PPA 187 Euro 197 doi, 10.1007-BF0935703. Mra 418461 a, QL, Xisto for C convergence of approximate and incremental subgradient methods for convex optimization. Siam Journal of Optimization 14 PPA 807 a Euro 840 DOI 10.1137 per second 105262340037636. 
Nra 2085944, Pattern Classification by Richard O. Dudner, Peter E. Hart, David G. Stork, ISBN 0-471-05669-3, 2000, Introduction to Stochastic Search and Optimization by James C. Spall, ISBN 0-471-33052-3, 2003, Software, SGD, an LGPLC++ library which uses stochastic gradient descent to fit SVM and conditional random field models. CRFA DFAC Toolkit of Stochastic Gradient Descent and its Feature Frequency Adaptive Variation for Training Conditional Random Field Models. External Links, Using Stochastic Gradient Descent in C++, Boost, Hublas for Linear Regression.